On September 18, 1931, a Japanese officer detonated a small bomb next to a railway line owned by a Japanese company in Manchuria, northeastern China. The bomb didn't do much damage, but what it did was give Japan an excuse to start a war. In September 1939, Nazi forces, pretending to be Polish anti-German militants, staged an attack on Glywitz Broadcasting Station as a pretext for the invasion of Poland, which led to the declaration of World War II. And this is just one of many attacks to uh, try to create the notion that Germany was the victim defending herself against attacks to provide justification for Germany to attack Poland, and yet it was Germany essentially attacking itself, making it look like it was Poland. You know, you see this in many marriages, too, when when the wife goes and talks to the pastor and says, He's evil! And yet, really, what's going on is she's attacking him and he's defending himself. You see, you see that, and I'm not just picking on wives, husbands do it too, I've seen that. I've seen it too, and then it comes out that the wife is the innocent one. Um, the United States itself, if we're going to talk about situations like this uh, on a national and international level, isn't innocent either. As Cold War tensions were at their crescendo in 1962, the Department of Defense and Joint Chiefs of Staff and the U.S. government contrived Operation Northwinds, which would have seen the CIA and others in the U.S. government stage terrorist attacks against its own citizens, its own civilians, and its own military targets. And then they would blame Cuba as a justification for military strike on Cuba. Thankfully, this did not go through. And it never happened. But it was still planned. 